another off season here in Lincoln, and we get an all access look of oh, Nebraska yeah. football. I've gotten through about half of this first one, mm -hmm. and as you would expect, really well done. Mm -hmm. um, you know, chronicling the Nash Hutmacher move to wrestling and. And, and just some of the things over this offseason. Ty Robinson talking about why he came back, right? Um, this is keeping in line. So we're talking about social media video, Twitter videos. I'm giving you a look inside Nebraska's program. Well, it's a 45-minute show. Okay, and it doesn't it, – it keeps – what what is largely defined the Matt Rule era so far, in your opinion? In my opinion, I would say transparency. He's very transparent. He's available a lot. Um, he wants you to see inside this program. Now, transparency is good. Also, what's good? Controlling, <laughs> controlling the message. This is a good way to control the message, right? He's showing what he wants you to show. The rule had to approve this, right? Probably the AD had to approve it. They're showing what, what they want you to see. But they're showing you... Things that are real and real watches every minute minute of this before it goes 100, you know, just to make sure. And I'm sure compliance and other people have to watch it over. But I do think it's cool. Like they're showing these when the recruits come, they always kind of do this huge all staff greet when they walk in the facility. Um, and they, those clips are cool. I mean, just yeah. the amount of, you know, camera work and archiving. It, it's a lot. I mean, I know some of the video we just watched was from June. It's quite a production. This is quite a production. Jordan um, Jordan does a really good job, Littler. Jordan. Um, you know, he puts these together, and he's a student, I believe, still. So, again, it gives you – this is very appealing. It shows you a very appealing aspects of the program. Football is not always appealing. Football is uncomfortable a lot of the time. But this shows you a level of comfort that's very appealing. Where, we saw Tony White, by the way, today in our – it was very real. Very real footage of him pulling up to his desk, sort of angry, right? You know, previous coaches like Frost or Polini, like it, it was just yeah, kind of like wasn't going to happen. I mean, it was a closed deal. Like it just not just Frost and Polini, all, Frank, all of, them, all of them, right? I mean, Nebraska. You don't have to agree with this. I've always felt it was pretty closed off. Riley was pretty open, yes, because he kind of let that social media team do what they wanted. I mean, Riley was an exception. Like, I mean, you, you saw, you know, guys like Kelly Mosier and that crew, they had pretty good access to bring stuff back then. I don't. Yeah. No, no, and I'm not being necessarily a critical of Nebraska, but it's always been its style to be a little more buttoned down. Now that was no, no, Sean, Tom Osborne worked in an era where there was, you didn't even, you couldn't have done this because there was no social media, you know, in the eighties, you, you couldn't have done this if you wanted to do well, it. Like any T would do like, you know, like a day in the life of Nebraska football. Like it, it, it would take months to put it together, you know, like, yeah, a, you remember like the specials they would do yeah. like that. I mean, that's what you had back then. Right. But there wasn't as widespread access to it now. Now, now there's just anybody can access this. So it's interesting. It's and it, but it, but the bottom line to me is it's kind of keeping with rules style of transparency, or maybe you would call it selected transparency. Um, you don't want to show everything, but you're showing a lot, and it gives the fans a, a really nice window into the program. And the facilities. Look at the facilities. I mean, right look at that Just thing. look at that, Sean. Are they on a spaceship, or is that a locker? I mean, it's <laughs> unbelievable. It does kind of look like a spaceship. It's like, are they up in the... They, nice. I mean, it's... it's beautiful. That don't, yeah, your, your Omaha gross locker room didn't look like that. No. At all, right? Neither uh, did Columbus High. No, not quite. Not quite like that. Not quite like that. We had see-through, like the the metal lockers, or like the yeah. like the mesh. Oh, the mesh. So did we. Yeah. And yeah. guys would take their towel and like you'd put a corner in the corner, yeah. you pull it through the mesh. Yep. That's how you dried your towel. That's how you dry, I don't think they're doing that over there right now. Yeah, the amount of bacteria in those locker rooms. Oh. I don't even know how we made it.